New at six, the Tri-Cities High School Athletic Director recorded slamming a student up against a wall. The school board is now considering suspending Kenneth Miller over this confrontation. Miller argues that his actions may have actually saved lives by preventing a school shooting. CBS 46's Krista Bowie is sitting down with Miller and his attorney tonight. This is footage released by the attorney representing Tri-Cities High School Athletics Director Kenneth Miller. In it, Miller is questioning a student who he said he saw on security footage pass a book bag with a gun to another student. Anytime you have guns and weapons on campus, plus a hostile environment where students have already been in altercations throughout the day and things of that nature, then yes, we could have possibly prevented something. Miller said when he confronted the student, things took a turn. The young lady became very belligerent, screaming, yelling, cursing, and slaps my hand and hits me, and I restrained her. Miller said he had no choice but to spring into action in his own self-defense to protect others from a girl he believed was dangerous. All the students made it home safe that day, including the young lady. All of the faculty and staff members made it home safe that day. But Fulton County Schools says his actions could violate portions of the Georgia Educators Code of Ethics. Originally, the school board was planning to terminate Miller, but is now reconsidered and will schedule a hearing to discuss possible suspension. I feel like accepting a suspension is uh, totally unacceptable simply because I don't feel like I did anything wrong. Crystal Bowie, CBS 46 News. A gun was found in the girl's book bag after the incident. We did reach out to the school district for comment. They said this is an ongoing investigation and they cannot comment until after the matter is concluded.